Just by the way, just by the way, His Holiness the Pope, John Paul II, he has just written a book called Crossing the Threshold of Hope by Pope John Paul II. It became the world's bestseller in 12 countries immediately on publication. In 12 countries it became the world's bestseller. In this book, he has some beautiful things to say about Islam and the Prophet Muhammad. But there is a chapter he has here in the book about Mary, the mother of Jesus. And the title of that chapter is Mother of God. Mother of God. That's the title. The title in the book he calls Mary, the title is Mother of God. And he is talking about having a dialogue. So if I had the opportunity of meeting His Holiness, I would have asked him, Your Holiness, you know, this Mother of God of yours, how many times is she mentioned in your book, the Bible? How many times? And I, I, I believe he is not expected to know that. And there isn't a Christian who can give me now. I give you, if I keep on giving this Quran away, I'd rather give you fifty dollars. Any Christian who can tell me how many times Mary, the mother of Jesus, is mentioned in your book. Fifty dollars. Put up your hand, please. I don't want anybody to shout. Just one second. Get, give, give somebody else a chance if there is. How many times is Mary, the mother of Jesus, mentioned in your Bible? Put up your hand, be fair to everybody, anybody. No, let's, let's try. Yes, my brother. I said the Christian. I want a Christian to answer that, please. Give the Christians a chance. Nobody there? Yes, my brother. Sir, I want to ask you a question. No, no. Why are you mentioning a money, sir, in this, uh, in this mission? Why is that, sir? Because the money is not involved, sir. Not involved, sir. My dear brother, simple question, simple. No, I was not trying to score any points. I said, how many time, how many time is Mary, the mother of God, your mother of God, Mary, how many time is she mentioned in your book? I said, the Pope is not likely to know that. It's not a part of his training. I don't blame him for that. I don't blame him for that. But I'm telling you now, there isn't a Christian born who can give me that offhand. There isn't. My brothers are walking away. They're walking away. Welcome to them. That's a prerogative. Your privilege. You have, you are not forced to come and listen. Mm -hmm. If you think it's too, too heavy for you. My... In, in South Africa, in my country, the African, you say, you know, it's too heavy. It's too heavy. <laughs> it's too heavy. I don't want you to carry the yoke. Mm -hmm. Now, let me tell you, let me tell you. Mary, the mother of Jesus, is mentioned in the first three books of the New Testament, Matthew, Mark, and Luke, 17 times. You can remember that now. 17 times. And in the next 24 books of the New Testament, once, total 18, word Mary occurs in the New Testament 18 times. In this Quran of mine, Mary, the mother of Jesus, is mentioned a hundred percent more times than in your Bible. Can you believe it? Is it believable? Mary, the mother of Jesus, is mentioned in my book 100% more times than in your book. And you think that we are the enemies. Actually, 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 32. Actually, 32. It's almost 18 times 2 is 36, this is 32. It's near enough. I said 100% more times. It's a, like a figure of speech, but 32 times, as against 18. This is the relationship. She, and, and, and there is a chapter, chapter in the Quran, in honor of the name of the mother of Jesus Christ. The name of the chapter is Surah Maryam, meaning chapter Mary. 
In your Bible, of the Roman Catholic 73 books, Mary is not one of them. In your Protestant Bible, 66 books, Mary is not one of them. You have Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, Peter, Paul. Mary is not one of them. Admit it is not there. In my book, it is enshrined Surah Maryam with the greatest respect in honor of the name of the mother of Jesus Christ. There is a chapter in the Quran.